Rafa, our FA Cup campaign's ended in the second round with defeat at Hartlepool today. What did you make of the performance? I thought we were uh, timid first half, and it, it, you know we're just um, we're not the same team that uh, put in a brilliant show last week, and um, also the same eleven that beat Bradford in the last round. So um, it was a surprise performance, you know how timid it was. You know we weren't strong enough, physical enough. Um, we didn't pass the ball well enough. The directives are obviously uh, pass it, pass it with pace, uh, pace and purpose, and. Um, and go and create, but there was a lack of quality. Is it all the more frustrating, as you say, on the back of last week's performance and a result that we hoped would breed confidence, but that didn't seem on show today? No, there was a distinct lack of quality and application, I thought. Um, all the lads who came off the bench showed um, a step up in intensity. That's, that's the sting in, in it all. That um, For an FA Cup game, a massive opportunity actually to put money into the coffers of the club. You know, we're working di day and night, you know, to to make it work uh, as a football club at this level. And whilst you can't budget for it, you know, uh, going going through rounds in the FA Cup, it certainly does help. And so uh, there was an in intensity off the pitch to, to do well. And um, woke up early this morning, really looking forward to a battle against Hartlepool and wanted to come out on top. Um, but, uh, you know, first half, we made life massively difficult. I didn't think they were creating too much, but we've conceded a free kick that's led to the first goal. And then, um, a penalty and, and obviously a sending off uh, resulted in uh, a sending off of, of Joe Matic and I was bitterly disappointed. And that was just before half time so it's always going to be difficult going into half time and then the second half 2-0 down and a man down but you mentioned the intensity of the substitutes who came on, is that a positive we can take away and a goal for Josh Coley, well, one he took well as well? Yeah well it, it's not fair if, if the players who came on and added an injection of, of pace, vitality and intensity if they go home uh, as dejected as as the rest of the group, perhaps, you know, I, I thought um, we didn't show enough um, personality first half, you know, and it was it was on all day, you know, the, the big switch. Sometimes you've got to be prepared to fail on that big, big switch uh, because when we did get it out there twice, we were up against a left winger playing left back uh, and we found a chance of hurting them. Um, but we didn't execute that um, and uh, we, we uh, went for other options in where there were lots of bodies in, in crowded areas and uh, and we got blocked off. Um, and if you're going to pass it into tight areas, you have to be able to deal with the ball better than we did. And and so it, it was uh, it, it was inviting trouble, and um, we got just as us. How do we go about creating that consistency from from last week's performance and all the positives that came with that to going from today and what was lacking? What what can we do to address? Um, well, we tried many things. You know, it, it's. Um, we talked about the personality, we talked about the characteristics, you know, be right in training, show the right, you know, intensity, which largely they have. Um, but it's, it's on a match day, we're all, we're all judged, and, you know, and players are judged, you know, if they've not got the right footwear for a start, one or two, you know, it's particularly galling, you know, because we, um, you can't be slipping around when no one else is. Um, and that for a start, you know, uh, that's, that also stings because that's about preparation. And, uh, you know, I've got a 10 year old um, a child that, I'm making sure that they've got the right studs so they don't slip up on Saturday morning football and you know this is professional football out here, it looks a bit daft. Alright, thank you for your time. Cheers.